Hello people, welcome to the 44th episode of the Cloudway podcast. That's a really weird pro because it sounded really weird. Um, so, what's, what's going on? Mm-hmm. Well, number one, videos has gone on. Number two, uh, more videos. Number three, I don't know. Okay, so let's do a bit of video recap. So, first video is my iMac G3 a year later. This is a video where I talk about um, my first two iMac G3s. I can't remember really which way is the offensive way and which one's not. Also, I did four, but just pretend you were like looking at one hand. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, so I did a video about as the discuss in those, um, I met what's happened, what's going on with them, what I plan to do, blah 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 blah. Yeah, I'll probably maybe do one for the iMac G5. And it's going to be way more boring. I'll tell you that. <laughs> After that, it's iOS 6 Maps Can Work Again. Map X Showcase. It's a video where I show you iOS 6 Maps working because of a tweak called Map 6. After that, Minecraft 1.20.1 on Mavericks. Yes, I got the well, basically the most re most recent major release of Minecraft on Mav macOS. Well, OS 10 Mavericks. Um, yeah, I mean the latest is 1.28.4, but. 1.20.1 is basically recent enough you could pretty much count it as the latest version because to be fair it was the latest version uh, actually no that's mine I was going to say it's the latest version until December I don't know. but um, I was thinking 1.20.2 because um, 1.20.3 and 1.20.4 released within a few days of each other um, version now, if I just go on Minecraft.wiki and do Minecraft 1.20.1 released. Oh, okay, that released in June, which to be fair felt like a what you could consider a while ago. And 1.20.2 was September, apparently. Okay. Um, sure. But yeah, when was 1.20 actually released? Oh, okay, it was released in June as well. Fair enough. Um, but yeah, um, so there's that. Um, what? Um, continuing on, it was pretty much recent. I couldn't really get recent versions working on Mountain Lion, even though theoretically it should be possible because there is Java 17 for Mountain Lion. Um, yeah, it works like the mount, the Java 17 works because I've got like 1.8.9 running on Java 17, um, but not like newer versions of Minecraft like they kept on. Fresh him. Um, yeah, it wasn't usable, it wasn't playable, but on Mavericks it was. So there's that. After that, video recapping Pro 23. A lot of it is recapping November because uh, that was uh, quite an unfortunate month, let's say. After that, upgrading of the Upgrading the RAM of the Powermatch G5 quad successfully. Powermatch G5 Adventures Episode 11. 
it is where I put um, two 256 meg sticks of RAM in there from the other quad to make 2.5 gigs of RAM, which is a not very nice number. I know that, but I will eventually get a RAM upgrade. Don't worry. If you go on like CX, you'll find um, RAM on here now. So it was in stock. Um, but if you go, come on, load. This website's not the greatest, but you know, a, a one gig stick is 10p. Um, two gig, 50p. Although the only problem is the delivery would be um, full stores. Yeah, it's in Reading. Reading's not very. Well, I mean, it's somewhat near me, but it's not even very collectible, so that's like a few hour drive from me, maybe like a two hour drive, let's say, and I don't drive, so I'd have to get my bed. Um, yeah, so that's not very usable, so delivery would be the option, and then delivery probably would cost quite a bit, so... In reality, it's not 50p, it's more like a couple of quid, essentially. Um, what's 8 times 2? 8 times 2 is 16. Um, also, there's a limit of 2 per item, and I don't even know if it's fully in stock. Last time I checked, it wasn't in stock. Yeah, it's only got one in stock as well for the 2 gigs. I'm assuming I went on the one gig there, which is why it said Reading, because Manchester's way far away. Um, check stock and store. Yeah. Yeah, there's one in stock there as well. So, yeah, it's not very well stocked. And I currently don't even have the money for it, so... <laughs> Well, I mean, I have more than 10p, but I don't have 50p. I have 30p currently. Actually, you know, as I said, delivery costs like way too much on here for some weird reason. Don't ask why, because I genuinely don't know why. Um, but yeah. Um, is that the other RAM, the six? 67 for like the that's like the sodium for like you know putting it to presence and iMac like this um is now back in stock uh i didn't actually check whether there's multiple in stock oh okay yeah there is um delivery is actually cheaper for this because ashford's way nearer to me um but, um, yeah, as I said, I don't have the money. I mean, 75p is too much anyway, currently. So, it's that. Um, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, so basically... I could get ran soon, but I did I had the money now, but I don't for now. Um, um, so yeah, that is the ram. Um, continuing on, um, I'm so I'm sick of these comments, so I've blocked them. Basically, I got a lot of this really started to annoy me. Cut your fingernails, blah blah. Um, scroll down, them nails, and uh, always keep them clean, blah, blah, put in mind if I haven't responded. Um, probably maybe. Uh, actually, I don't know. If I do that, get rid of filters, you'll probably see. Basically, it's just really good someone now so I've just blocked it if I go into settings can 
mean to scroll down. Um, I thought I'd say I've got five minute craft. Yeah, tap now, shall out. Do I dare say a clean? I'm going to ban that word as well. So, these are the words you cannot say. If you bypass them, you're getting kicked out of my comment section. Simple as that. Unless you're mean it in a different context, then I'll be fine. Publicly subscribed for you to me for a month. I'm curious, so you just. I mean, um. Do, 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 do. This username's amazing. I've probably showed this channel before, but oh, yes. Different icon now, but. Um, still, I could probably show you Woods of Fox. I'm pretty sure it's space, but like the War Fox. Uh, okay, maybe it was just Firefox. Uh, of course, it doesn't appear. Um, maybe I've changed the word to logo. Ah, I don't. But basically, it's that more just described. Also, like those only appear. Those red things only appear when um, yeah, you've got your subscription public. Um, do do. Oh, here's that person again. It said months ago before they subscribed, or maybe they unsubscribed. Don't know. Um, but yeah, I guess it's just um. Oh, another person. 10 months yeah yeah here's another comment just shut up <laughs> so yeah um comments Numbers, do I see some numbers? I don't know. Well, let me get a consumption of drink. Mm. So, that went on the screen. Here's some numbers last 28 days. Um, how many have I got in the year? 7,000. <laughs> Isn't that like the same amount I've got in the whole of 2022? I think that's the same. Well, around the same. I think I've got about 7,000. So, 2022 to... Yeah. Can I do this without being annoyed with the thing? Uh, i do that. Go done. 7320. Yeah, I've got more. I've got more this year alone than the whole of 2022, which is just funny. Already. We're not we're only a month and a half in really. You could argue, you know, whatever it's February it's only twenty-nine days because it's actually a leap year this year. But it is what it is. Um, what things do I have to talk about? Um, so, hopefully, CPU upgrade will be arriving next week. I don't know if I've said this before, for the um, for, uh, iMac, 2007 iMac. Um, this will allow me to get 
Mac OS versions newer than um, what's it called? Um, then um, El Capitan on there um, because of the it's point SSC four point one or four point two. I thought it was four point two, but I've some conflicting information saying it's four point one. I don't know. It's one of those. Um, that it, like the new CPU has that the old one doesn't, which is why I can't get you know, old cap turn above on there. Um, but yeah, it's from for some reason those CPUs are all like from China, so that's why it's gonna take quite a while. Um, uh, I think it had like an ETA from you know Monday, um, to you know, whatever. I think it's like a week range, week's worth of range. I want to see one terabyte SSDs. Um, but yeah, quid if you want a one terabyte SSD, or you could go for a SATA, which is more expensive. How much would an adapter be for an SSD? I don't know if I go on like Amazon.co.uk. Um, that's not my postcode. Um, it's this um, M.2 to SATA adapter, it's got to be the right way. Um, hell quid, it's one for five quid. Got that. Think about this. Um, five quid. Well, it's actually six quid. Six quid. And hopefully it actually work. Um, yeah, you could save a bit of six. Yeah, you could save one quid. <laughs> actually, I mean, depends where this is in stock. Um, I should have just clicked on that because technically the delivery. Um, all stores. Yeah, the Palmer's Green is that London? Um, yes, Middlesex parts. That's like North E. No, West. I mean, I'm I'm neither direction. Which I mean, yeah. So. I don't know, there might be more like cheap SSDs that aren't Western Digital. Um, drive type none, form factor. Yeah, we had quid for a Samsung. Um, I'll sort by the price. A good idea. Oh yeah, there's a crucial for forty quid. Yeah, probably save money. Wait, no. No, it was in the Western Digital thirty eight quid. <laughs> you got an in Intel SSD. I don't know, I just find the idea of Intel SM SSD is funny. Do say AMD ones, but like. I believe Intel actually manufactured them, unlike um, AMD. I don't think AMD do them. Um, the Radeon branded SSDs. I just find it so funny. Um, yeah. Want a laptop SSHG from Seagate? That's gonna die. Um, Thirty quid. <laughs> Spend your money. Yeah. Um, so I go into computing. Do do. Store data storage. Do 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 do. do. I've got like terabyte hard drive from CX, but like uh, yeah, hard drives. Uh. Yeah, if you go SATA SSD, 
these and storage one terabyte. There we go, and this is okay. You can get an Ultra 3G um, SSD for very accurate. That would actually eliminate the need for the adapter. Oh, it's out of stock. Yeah. Yeah, so this is the problem. So you actually either out of stock, delivery is expensive, or yeah, it's a bit annoying. This one in stock. Yes. Where's in stock? All stores. <laughs> Red car. <laughs> Nowhere near me. Um, just so you know. Um, yeah. So I'm just, I'm sorry, I swear these podcasts somehow end up at me just like looking at CX, seeing these things. Also, you wouldn't know how old these SSDs are. They could die any moment, although I've not had a dead SSD at all, but to be fair, my oldest SSD, as far as my, I'm aware, is, you know, 2019, is it 29? Yeah, I think it's 2019, um, actually doing this will get you dodgy ones, I forget, I am going to probably do low tight to see like a bunch of dodgy listings which is really annoying let's be real um Kingston that's actually 960 so technically not what I asked for although I didn't do a filter I did a search did I um no name brand you know you could go for that and if you wanted to go new you know Go with like, you know, Western Digital or Crucial or Samsung, you know, Samsung I feel like tend to be too expensive. That one's like a bit more expensive. Um yeah. Go for a plus but it's actually an ultra but that's an ultra but with an ultra three D in it listing name, you know, okay. Yeah, this is where it gets a bit sort of dodgy. With CX, you'd argue it's a bit more safe, uh, you could say. You know what I mean? Look at this. This one where you can flex the size, or is it? No, it's not. Yeah, I think you get the idea. Yeah, that's like the Toshiba hard drive I've got. Just saying. Um. This is like the PX500. I've got like one of these. But I think it mines 480. Um. What else is there to say? Um, do, do, um, I may have fed the instance, that's probably not interesting enough for this audience. Um, you know, I think the main big thing is just like me getting Minecraft on older versions of Mac OS. Well, I've got some arm warmers, didn't bring them down. Um, came with matching socks as well. Um, yeah, I really apologise these videos are very short. It's weird because um, the Iron Mac, Intel Iron Mac adventures are like significantly longer. Look, 1 hour and 21, 1 hour and 49. Um, I mean, this isn't actually sure, but yeah, there are some videos on here that aren't podcasts that are longer than these. A decent chunk of these podcasts, which is just ridiculous. I, I, maybe, yeah. You know, I think, as I said, I should start doing notes. To be fair, I definitely, I'm pretty sure I've done notes before. 
and even with notes, I still struggled with length. I mean, they were more like talking points. They weren't like actually really detailed. But yeah, I think once I stopped doing these daily videos, it will start to be a bit more full of content, I would say. But also there's a risk that the content could be content to talk about really could be more sparse because of these videos sometimes I really go on and ramble on some talking about some of these videos so maybe it's not the case but yeah it sort of really depends I guess um yeah so I guess that gonna be it for today hopefully you enjoyed this and goodbye bye